My name's Yvette Hart. I own and manage my own nursery, which I've done for the last 16 years. We're doing some training today on the EYPS written assignment process. So I'm really looking forward to meeting up with everybody because I haven't seen them for, well, since we were last here, about a month and a half. So it'd be really good to meet up with friends and have a chat. Good, yeah, not too bad, thanks. Yeah, not too bad. So, thank you. <laughs> did you get one all right in your assignment? Yeah, 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 yeah I did, yeah. yeah. I didn't actually have much confidence in the beginning in my own abilities and in myself. But actually coming on the course, there's a lot of us that are my age, much older, got sort of grown-up children. And that has been really nice because I think we all support each other. I think it would probably be a good idea for you to just have another one look at the task, read it through, make sure that you get a feel for how this candidate has tackled this piece of work. Okay. I feel that in doing this course, I'm really at the forefront of what, what is happening, all the, the best ideas, the newest ideas, and I can bring those out to the staff, which has been brilliant. This is one of my favourite times of the day, because it's just nice to meet, meet up and chat with colleagues and other professionals and people that are in the same job as you, um, who've sort of got similar problems, you know, we're all sort of juggling about 100 things at once, that's really nice to get that support from everybody else. We do support each other very well. If somebody's feeling really down over an essay, you just email or phone somebody and that other person will say, no, you're not giving up, you're not doing anything. And we support them that way. Be thinking about what you've got in your reflective logs that you've all been keeping, I know. Take each photo and then find time to print them and laminate them and all that. Initially, Juggling work and studying seems quite overpowering, but in the first sort of um, the first term we were here, you're given lots and lots of documents and, and time to consider how you're going to use your use your life that you've got now, which is obviously very very full and busy, and how you're actually really going to fit the studying in. You're assigned a mentor, which you can use at your leisure. Um, she's there on the end of the phone or email for you to use. Um, you also have full support of all the staff here. Um, you've got their emails, you can contact them, and they're really quick at emailing back, usually within 24 hours. What are you thinking about doing for baby stuff? Well, I'm thinking about maybe doing planning, because we've changed it all. All right, planning. So we're not to two. Yeah. We had some really, really great training on speech and language therapy, actually, and that really revolutionised what I was doing with the children. And there's been so many experiences like that. I mean, like, policy can be a really boring thing to have to talk about and listen to, and they made it really interesting. It just becomes so, so natural and just so easy. And you want to learn more and you want to do, have a really nice assignment to hand in and you, you feel fantastic when you get a great result back. It's a real confidence boost. You're getting to know why you're doing what you're doing, why children are behaving in the way that they behave, why your staff are behaving in the way that they behave. Um, and your staff actually respect you because you've got the knowledge to back up what you're trying to carry out at work and what you're asking them to do. I think the parents and the staff have all commented um, how the practice has improved. For the whole setting, um, I think it's inspired other individuals to, to continue with their learning. And I know my deputy's just started a foundation degree with the um, idea of coming here afterwards to do a EYP. It's a really modern qualification. It's very forward-looking, it's very contemporary. It's a very new role that it's forging out for itself, and I'm really passionate about it. It's a good day. Yes. I think historically, childcare is seen as staying at home, looking after the babies. You don't particularly need any qualification to do it. And I think the EYPS has turned that whole way of thinking on its head. I think the EYPS has increased my professional credibility. Mm -hmm.